Now, forewarned weather with Exact Track 4D. You know, we had a taste of just how great it can be this time. <laughs> it of year. was so, so we can, wonderful. We can do it again, Kim. We can do it. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. But, we'll but not for very long because on Thursday, that's going to be it. And then it gets cold again, again. for yeah. the weekend. So, but we can, we can get there for one day this week. We're trending in the right direction. We're going to get into the upper 50s tomorrow, but we have to get through a very cold night tonight. And it will be a cold morning tomorrow. 41 in Detroit, 37 in Howell, upper 30s in Pontiac, 40 right now in Adrian. The weather story, well, we are going to have approaching record territory on Thursday with highs getting into the upper 70s. The record is 82. We'll get close to it. And then rain chances through Sunday, but not all day rain. So I'm going to time that out for you so you can kind of plan your next few days. Colder, though, for the weekend. So let's start with tomorrow. For your morning commute, nice and dry. You'll need your sunglasses. Sunny skies throughout the morning. A few clouds roll in around the noon hour. And then in the afternoon, you'll notice skies will start to cloud up. And then the rain will be off to our north and west. During the evening, hours we can be clipped by a few of these showers and possibly even some heavier downpours especially north of m59 so keep that in mind for tomorrow rain chances the best chance will be friday and saturday this week so let's talk about that we'll start with thursday at 8 a.m we've got this warm front down to our south as it lifts up throughout the day that's when all that warm air surges in and we get into the upper 70s possibly even close to 80 degrees but the showers and thunderstorms that are the heaviest are back attached to this cold front. So once that gets through during the morning hours on Friday, we could get some pretty decent downpours. And then another area of low pressure moves in for the weekend and brings us some rain as well, at least for the first half of the weekend. Let's talk about this roller coaster ride of temperatures. Our normal high is now 60. Tomorrow will be at 57, so just a shade below it. By Thursday, that's the warmest day of the week with highs in the upper 70s, upper 60s for Friday, so not bad. And Tomorrow and Thursday will actually get a lot of dry periods, so it's going to be pretty nice for the next couple of days. Most of the rain falls while you're sleeping at night, and then Saturday turns much colder with a high of only 54. So the only day really that we're in record territory would again be on Thursday with that record set in 1985 of 82 degrees. So your forecast for tonight, freezing literally down to 32 degrees. Some of the suburbs, I wouldn't be surprised if you drop down into the upper 20s. And then for tomorrow, we we get a little sunshine, but some clouds build in the afternoon. Rain holds off until the evening with highs in the upper 50s. Here's your future forecast, and it does look like we'll have rain mainly in the morning on Friday. Earth Day, Saturday, showers, possibly even heavy at times, and that cold rain as temperatures will only be in the upper 40s to low 50s. Sunday highs only in the upper 40s, but it does look like in the afternoon we'll get a little sunshine and still below normal even through the beginning of next mm -hmm. week. So as kids start their spring sports season, Saturday morning's going to be so cold yeah. and rainy. Yeah. yeah. All right.